and dear laddies, my name is Jacksepticeye and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. Now, today we are going to make something a little bit sneaky. We're gonna build like the Frankenstein monster. Uh, we're gonna build a plocket. Somebody left a really good suggestion in the comments of the last video saying that I should make something that is a rocket, but I can detach my engines when I go up into the air and turn it into a plane and then glide it back and land it safely on the ground. Now, I don't know, I can't remember if they said land it at the airport or not, but I'm not gonna be able to do that, because I can barely even do that when I do it properly. So, I'm just gonna build a thingy. A thingy bobber. Uh, I might go with this guy. Because I like this guy. I really like him. He's a good guy. He's- no, I'm not gonna go with him. He's too big. Uh, this dude. Yeah, you will make for a nice aerodynamic plane. Um, so what kind of fuel- I- I have like an idea in my head how I'm gonna do this. There's gonna be wings at the side like a normal plane that's gonna have control surfaces and a back. It's basically just gonna be a plane with attachable rockets on the sides. And the plane isn't gonna be able to like boost on its own when it comes out of the rockets. It's just gonna glide around. So it's gonna be a glider after it's a fucking rocket. So this could go bad. Uh, we need fuel though. Mm. You, you're too big. So it's these guys. These guys. Uh, might put three on it. See, there's not gonna be anything at the back. Or should there be? See, I don't know how this is gonna work. I've never done this before. It's actually a really cool idea. Ah, uh, I might just, yeah, so normal boosters, not actual, not actual rockets, not like thrusting rockets that I can control. It's just gonna go up into the air and when the boosters run out, yeah, I'm just gonna come back down to ground. Um, no. Oh Jesus, no, those are the big gigantic wings. Ho <laughs> ho! Oh, hold on there a minute, Sunny Jim. Maybe these? I don't like these wings though, because they're really fat. What kind of wings does a guy want to use? Oh, these are the wings. These are the ones I'm gonna use. These are the ones I'm gonna use. Because those, like, tilt on their own, I don't have to put control surfaces on them. I don't think. Nah. <laughs> uh... Is there even a point of having these then? There isn't, is there? Like I'm not putting fuel into- or I'm not putting a rocket on the end of this. Maybe if this works well, I can build another one. So for this, all I need is like empty fuselage. So like it's not really heavy. Are you, are you empty? Structural fuselage section. Style for overhaul. Yeah, you, you're fine. You're good! You are better than fine. You are great. Uh, I might have to put something on the end of it, just to section it off. Oh god. You? Oh, why are you guys all weird? Uh, ah, you. Oh, it's you. It's you, it's you, it's you. The only one I want. Um, that's a real song, by the way. I am very lyrically gifted. Look what you want. See, this is gonna be really tricky. For, for normal people, for me, it's gotta be fucking insanely impossible. But, yeah, I have to like, judge my center of mass and my center of lift, sideways. Oh, Like, cause that's the way I would set it up as a plane, but when the thing comes off, it's gonna be a different story, it's gonna be a different kettle of barrels. Mm. When I put uh, boosters on it, it's gonna weigh it down anyway, so the weight's gonna change. Ah, uh, so boosters. I need decouplers. Where decouplers are in structure? Decoupler. Ah, uh, that's three. Ah, uh, three boosters. Yeah, to balance it out. Because these are going to act as like the fins anyway. Ah, uh, I need wheels on this. Shit. This is a lot more complex than it looks. I'm gonna put that one. Okay, I'll just do them individually then. Put one there. One there. Are those good? No, they're not. One of them is arseways. You. You're arseways. Now you are perfect. Nice. <sighs> Maybe I should put the wheels on first. That might be a good idea. Oh, but what wheels to use? This is. This is really tricky. This is really complex. Never thought of doing this before. It's really a good idea. Thank you. 
Thank you! Ah, uh, see, and when you double them up, they go the opposite side of the wing. Ah, uh, just single them then. Ah, fuck off. Like so. I'll try and line them up along that. There, so that's as perfectly symmetrical as I can get. That I am going to allow myself to get. Ah, uh, put one of you up here. <laughs> oh, I'm looking forward to seeing if this works. It's not gonna. <laughs> oh, I'm so boned. Uh, raise gear. Really like these cool ideas, though. I, I'm, I was trying to think. I started up Kerbal Space Program. I was like, yeah, let's record Kerbal Space Program today. Then I was like, wait, what the fuck am I gonna do? Like, I, I literally had no idea what I was gonna do when I got into it. I was trying to think of rocket designs off the top of my head really quickly, and I couldn't. I couldn't think of any of them. So I went to the comments, and then I saw this, and this is just this is such a good idea. And had a lot of likes as well. And a lot of people seemed to want to see it as as well, so I thought I'd do it. I might put tail fins on this then. Just to be just to be nice, you know. Just to be a nice guy. So double you up like that. So see, it's just a plane with boosters, and you're going to the moon. I don't know. They said the comment actually said to get to space and then decouple and fly back down to Earth, but I don't know if I'll be able to do that. Oh god, I can't even see my staging. Staging is perfect. It's just what I want. Now I need clamps. Clampatronios. Where are you? There we go. Can you actually stick to this? Oh, this is gonna be a bit awkward. Um like that? No, you can't stick. Why is the opposite one not able to stick? Ah, shit. Shit, shit, shit. How am I gonna do this? Like that. That's how I'm gonna do this. This is gonna be wildly unstable. Oh, This is not gonna work, but it's gonna be fun to try it anyway. It's gonna be fun to test it out. I like testing shit. And I, I also like explosions. I think I'm Michael Bay's lost brother. Oh god. At least it looks formidable. And go! Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. I didn't have my staging right. Let's try that again. I, I had no idea what was going on there for a second. <laughs> my clamps didn't release. Look at my clamps off up there like little bitches. And I, uh, yeah, you're gonna go all at the same. Okay, throttle up! And go! Shit. Shit. Stay, stay straight. Stay straight! Perfect! I have created life! This is fun! This is how all space travel should be done from now on. Screw those big ugly rockets. Just do shit like this. Why is the plane weird? Oh, because my fingers are on the wrong buttons. Oh. I'm going hypersonic! Oh, I'm becoming unstable. That's okay. That is okay, and release! Yes! Fucking amazing! I am high! High as a motherfucker! <laughs> okay, let's try and tilt this guy forward. Ah, See, I'm just- I'm so streamlined that I'm just still going straight up. Oh look, there's the other airport! Hey, buddy! Okay, we're starting to fall forward now. Nice! <laughs> this is cool, I have a lot of pimples on my back. A lot of spots. Okay, don't go too fucking high. Are you in space? No, I'm not. <laughs> I almost am. Okay, here we go. We're gonna have to like steer back down. So the air brushes over my wings and points me back towards the ground. Nice! Now it's up to the gods to see how this thing actually controls. Oh, to see if it actually glides, if my center of mass and all that kind of stuff is good. I think the weight might be too far forward. You are dropping like a freaking stone. And I'm pulling back and it's not doing anything. I'm not like, zooming back up. Uh-oh. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's not pulling up. It's not pulling up, I'm just dropping. Shit! 
I'll pull out my wheels anyway and see what happens. <laughs> Maybe they'll add some drag. Will my wheels come out? My wheels didn't even come out! Fucking lower gear! Lower gear! The back one did, did it? No, it didn't. Oh! Oh! Here we go! Yes! Oh, so good. Oh, so good. I like this plane. I like this. I like this design. It, it even looks cool as well as actually flying. It's everything I wanted in a child. It's hard to tell, but I actually am moving. And I'm not pulling up anymore. I, I'm trying, but it's not working. This is not good. Maybe it's because the control surfaces aren't actually on this. Oh, am I tilting a bit more? I think I'm pulling back up a bit more. Am I or is the ground just changing? Ground's changing because this isn't changing. <gasps> I'm just gonna explode. I'm just gonna explode. Fuck, 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 fuck. Kerbals! Kerbals! Jebediah! No! Eee! Ah! Some of it survived. Not all of it though. Man, I was close! Back to the drawing board. I might change the wings on this, because I don't know if they were good or they let me down and that's a wheel and I wasn't supposed to do that. Hmm, because I can't add control surfaces to them either because they're angled. Maybe these guys? These guys are good wings. These definitely have control surfaces on them. Oh god, that's our space. Oh, don't do that, Jack. It's hard enough to do it the way it is. Oh, there we go. Actually, I might pull the wings up a bit. Hmm. This might work now. Okay, I have to think about this, because when I excrete these, when I eject these off the ship, my center of mass is gonna change. Where does it go is a, another question. Maybe if I just try removing one? I'll remove all three and see where the center of mass disappears to. Because the center of mass goes way forward. Maybe that's why it wasn't working. Because the weight was too far forward so my nose just kept dipping down. So I might have to change this. Oh god. So it may look weird now, but I think my science is good behind that. I really do. I really feel like I am onto something. When I put the boosters back on... Ah no, don't double them up. It'll change the center of mass again, but that's fine. That's good. That's that's great. I suppose I could change the center of mass. Oh no. Anyway, I could change it the way it is already, just by doing this. So like the lift is right in line with it already anyway. I could move these guys down, I guess. Oh no, move these up. As well? Because now I know the center of mass isn't going to change once the things are ejected. I have that sorted and I have that set up. You're off. You're awful bad at aligning. Ha. Ah. Ha. Ah. There. Yeah! Super rocket! I think this is going to work this time. I really believe in my heart and soul. Okay, you're, I can move you guys up then a small bit. Actually, I can do this. Perfect. Much more stability. This is cool! I don't know what it looks like. It reminds me of something. I don't know what it is. It reminds me of a plocket. Oh, look at those little clamperoos. Trying to be sneaky. Going back up there again. Okay. Let's throttle up and go! Please stay straight. This stays straighter than my rockets. My actual rockets. This is phenomenal! Oh! Balzac! Didn't put wheels on it! Fuck! Look, it's okay. I'm gonna be that good a pilot that it's gonna work. And this thing gets wildly unstable right before the fuel runs out. Or it doesn't, and it's fine. And see you later! Nice! I like this. I like it a lot. Thank you for this suggestion. Look at this! It tilts forward already! Wow! Okay! 
don't know if that's good or bad now. I have a feeling it might be bad. <laughs> oh, it looks like one of those fish that can fly. That's what it looks like. You see them hopping out of the water and they like glide along a tiny bit. Oh yeah, see if I'm a good pilot I can land without wheels anyway. You guys see. Why is there like a little square on the back of it? What does that do? I don't know, but this thing is actually really easy to control all of a sudden. I like it. I'm gonna land it. Should we go over to the Himalayas over there? That'd be nice, right? A little, get a little Himalaya action going. Go over and vid visit Himalaya Joe. Be nice. It'd do you good to get out of the house once in a while. Instead of sitting in, watching Carpet Space Program all the time. I just joking. I love you guys. And I am in perfect level flight. Well, not perfect level flight, but like, I am good. I am solid. I am gliding. So good! My plan is to like, slide this onto the ground. I know you can do it if you like come at the right angle or whatever, but <laughs> I have a feeling this isn't gonna work. My little wheel at the back, which does come out. Nice! See, if that bounces, I'm, I'm boned. That's gonna bounce and like, smack my nose into the ground, so I don't know whether to leave it down or up or... Oh god, please just land. Look! I'm gliding so slowly. Not only was that a really successful launch, that's one of the most successful planes I've ever made as well. Okay, we gotta like, go almost level with the ground coming in. We're just gonna glide in nicely. If it doesn't work, then you're all gonna die. SHIT! Okay, I gotta do it one more time and put frickin' wheels on it. Wheels are on, Jack is gone! Yeah! I fucking love this! Good suggestion! Oh, and I love the wind effects! Me breaking sound barriers and shit like a boss! And then... Oh, see you later, boosters! You served me well! Oh, this is a calm episode. I have exploded a number of times, but it's still a calm episode. Oh, dudes, we are so gonna land this bad boy. So gonna land this bad boy. Okay, take off the time warp. There we go. God, I'm traveling much slower than I thought I was. Is that a hill up there? You can't see any outlines in the ground. Okay, so if, they, if those are hills up there, I should probably just go for this because this is all flat. The flatlands. The salt lands. Kerbal, you are... Oh. Another time. When I get better at this. Because this is fun. I'm going to do this in another episode. When I get better at it, I'm going to put an engine back on this. And then I'm gonna be able to like come. Yes. Okay, brakes, but not too much brakes, because too much brakes makes you fall forward like that. Amazing, actually worked. Most successful launch I've ever had, ever. That was so good. That was awesome. We are gonna save you as the plocket, the plane rocket. If that wasn't clear to some of you, by the way, I just realized that might not have been, but yeah! I'm gonna leave this episode here because I feel like we got a lot done and I want to do some more in the next episode and it's a bit too much to be cramming into this one. I do want to add more boosters eventually and go actually into space and then maybe add more engines later on that I can use after, so next time I will go, I'll go up like I normally did and I'll come back down and then when I land, I'll launch an engine again and I'll like take off and I'll try and land back at the airport again and then I'll add more boosters and I'll go up into space and I'll try and come back from space and land again. It's gonna be awesome! But thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch that like button in the face like a boss! And high fives all around! Whoosh, whoosh. Thank you guys and I will see all your dudes! Little robot thing. Can we do a loopy loop? We can and we will and we do. That's how we roll. Ooh,